single it should be. 72 they put on. Dwayne Smith. Oh, oh, there's a run out. Surely, what is happening here? He needs to pull the stuff out. This is a comedy of errors. Record this, guys, if you're at home when the replay comes along and play it a hundred times and you won't stop laughing. Not if you're Mahindra Singh Dhoni. They had, I think, at least four opportunities to run Dwayne Smith out. Right now, there's going to be an overthrow that's building laps number one. There it is. Now, Suwan says no. And there he is. He misses it once. Now he's already broken the stump. So the fielder coming in has now got to pull the stump out. And it goes between his legs. This is a serious international level cricket. Can you believe all that? A Trevor Chapel impersonation to bring the house down here at this tour opener. The stage is made for Billy Batten. <laughs> it has been that sort of night. <laughs> Nearly as famous as many years ago with a smile. Huge problem here, Tendulka. Oh well, he might still be in. This is absolute circus out there. There is an absolute circus. Take a breath, everyone, because you're going to have to see this in slow motion. Here's the last ball. In the air, he doesn't get it. They've gone for one. They'll come for two. There's an invasion, and the return comes in. Madness here at border. Absolute chaos. Someone's going to get injured out there. They're harassing the players. This is dangerous now for the players in the middle. Somebody snatched a bat. The police are out there surrounding Steve Waugh. He's been jostled and pushed. Oh. Now this is close. A definite run out here. In fact, Inzamam's going to the other end. And he might just be saved here. But the third empire will be called for. Now what will be interesting to see is when the ball hit the stumps on the full. It might just be a case that both the batsmen have not made their ground. I didn't think either uh, batsman was in at the non-striker's end. Inzamam had moved out of his crease. I'm not sure why he hadn't gone back to his crease. Yusuf Yohana suddenly decided that he was going. Saba Karim's throw has hit. Now, one of them's got to be out. But I don't think he's called for the third umpire. Now, that's really surprising. I think Inzamam is out here. I, uh, I'm not too sure about the law, but I have a sneaking feeling that Inzamam might be the one to go. Yes, just seeing from that angle, Ian, I think I might have to change my mind because uh, you can't see Johanna really crossing Inzamam. From this angle, you feel that he's crossed him. Now, the batsmen have to cross. Now, if Johanna has crossed Inzamam and the third empire sees it, now, this will give you a clear picture. He hasn't really crossed Inzamam from this angle. His bat's still behind Inzamam's. And the ball hits the stumps there. OK, now they've got the problem. He flashes up the, the light, but who's going to go? Because that won't tell the umpire out in the middle who's it, which one's got to go. Yes, he's going to tell the third umpire. In fact, the third umpire will have a chat with Peter Manuel and tell him that Johanna is out. Now, these are situations you don't see often on a cricket ground. Both batsmen running towards the same end. One angle giving you an impression that Johanna had not crossed in Zamam. Another angle 
tells you something different. But the third umpire has made his decision. One batsman had to go, that was for sure. Johanna has to pay the price for it. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe. Oh.